One of the interesting things about you when I saw you play over the years, your discipline got so good. Mm -hmm. Do you attribute that to hard work or just patience or just experience? Two things, yeah. the experience. I know pitchers were gonna try to get me chasing pitches out of the strike zone. If I walk into that game, same thing that we were talking about, Aaron Judge. Yeah. You walk out of your zone, that's gonna cause you trouble. I try to stay compact on my song. I work extremely hard on not leaving the strike zone because I, I wasn't Vladimir Guerrero that can't hit pitches out here, up here, way in, down here, no. I have my zone level right here that I know that I can do some damage. So I, used to, I work extremely hard every day on stay on that zone because the minute I walk out of it, it was trouble, just now, like everybody else. Two last questions, Poppy. How much of the presence, when you walked up to the plate and you came here, <laughs> how much of that was your mojo, but also intimidation? And how much was it just pure, just you were just that much of a better hitter? You know, it's, it's, that's a great question. I want to make sure, walking to the plate, that the pitcher know that I was there, mm -hmm. that I was gonna come to do some damage. Mm -hmm. So I would take my time. A lot of people criticized me because I was taking my time. <laughs> it was just concentration, it was the focus. Mm -hmm. When I was in and out, I don't think I, I was at my best. But when I was taking my time and thinking about my homework, what I did before, my game plan against the guy that was in the mount, that was when I was putting my best out of the game. In, 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 Work out for me. You know, Poppy was one of the best, Mike, and I'm going to yeah. tell you something right now. Uh -huh. When you play for over 22 years, and we've both played for a long time, you get to watch a guy come out of the dugout, and if he came out of the dugout, I was playing third base, I would see Poppy. With his body language, with the hop in his step, I knew if he felt good, bad, or great. And as players, learning to read body language, pitchers, hitters, is so important, is a vital part of development. It's almost like an intimidation factor walking up to that plate as well. You guys had that intimidating factor at the plate. Talking about Pedro, yeah. he also was very intimidating. I, I noticed those that pretty well coming from you also. Yeah. Like you see that body language. You see, it's, it's a prototype that you don't see on every player. You see, man, there's a few, very few players that you can see that toe step walking towards the plate. You can tell, oh, this guy, oh, here we go. Here we go again. You know what I'm saying? Like, you, you got that feeling. Picture sense that also.